to present my new Dell Latitude E2620. This is a original install. The only thing that is showing wrong in device manager is uh, my temporarily second Bluetooth adapter. Oh, it's working. Oh yeah, disabled it. My Wi-Fi module also has a Bluetooth adapter. It will be replaced by another one. That's the AR9285 we're talking about. It's going to be re replaced by the same model, only without the Bluetooth. the device ID. Well, I don't have to show you guys that everything works in Windows. I guess you will believe that. Airport. The belly percentage is shown now, although I have some problems with that. Sometimes it disappears, and the screen will flicker when uh, it drops a percentage. It's very responsive. Did you see that flash? That's what I'm talking about. can do this all day.
the mouse is a bit wiggly, very uh, sensitive. So I can watch TV anywhere. Also the scrolling works. So, and also games work. Oh, uh, it's still in the day, huh? I get out of this. <laughs> oh. I don't want to play Angry Birds Cop. I want to get back. Ah. So, that's my Android demonstration. And the final demonstration is another drive. Oh. I think it was this one. Put up okay, my uh, USB adapter for this demonstration. I will lose a little speed, but that's not a big problem. The only thing that won't boot this way is Windows. F12. Only these drives fail sometimes. We're going for USB Legacy, because I'm using Duet on this laptop. Hey, there's a lot of more. So this is uh, the USB and this is the drive you just saw. So we have Windows and we have 10.9.5. <laughs> Sometimes it just comes back. I want to take a look at the Bluetooth. Yeah, well, Broadcom, so it must be working now. That's uh, 
the internal Bluetooth, the Dell Wireless 375. Okie dokie, also internet works, sound works. in Android. Yeah, I just pick something. A little shock. It doesn't. Hello. It doesn't shock like that in 10.11. So, but I'm using this for other purposes. It's really stupid. Windows cannot boot from USB normally. It's probably some trick to do it, but I haven't investigated. I mean Linux, Android, Mac OS, they, they don't have problems. You can even boot Mac OS from a USB stick. The only thing is you don't want that because it's very slow. Yeah, it doesn't really matter which drive I take because Clover is installed on both. Yeah, I just want to browse it. I believe it's that thing over there. And we must have Ice Weasel. Ice Weasel. Yes, slow again because it's connected via USB. Again, those chicks. Nice, eh? And the last thing I want to show you guys is this. No more USB drive.
they're going. Off. Look, now it says hibernated. We're gonna count. One, two, three, four, five, six, and I'm in. Six seconds. Well, guys, I hope you liked uh, my video, and uh, there's gonna be some uh, more videos. I have another latitude, and I'm also gonna do a video about the E6430 which this is also possible on, almost like this. See you guys.